Navjot Singh Sidhu, never a man of few words, is totally silent now. It's an incredible development in the Punjab potboiler amidst this big statement from Navjot Singh Sidhu's wife saying one of us may consider retirement. Uh, Manjeet Segal continues to be with me live from uh, State of War Punjab. Manjeet, you know, Navjot Singh Sidhu, Rahul Gandhi had declared from that stage last week in Jalandhar that both Navjot Singh Sidhu and Charanjit Singh Channi had pledged and promised to him that they would be on their best behaviour and support the other in case the chief ministerial face is not them. In case it is Channi, then Sidhu will support him. In case it is Sidhu, then Channi will support him. That was the impression that Rahul Gandhi had given from the stage, uh, you know, as part of a projection of unity in this war between the Sardars of the Congress party. But what Sidhu has done, correct me if I'm wrong, Manjeet, is already break that promise. He's gone into a sulk, he's abandoned party work and demonstrated that he is the king. He is the, you know, when it comes to Singh is king, he doesn't want any other Singh in the battlefield. It's only him. Yes, indeed, Shiv. In fact, uh, Navjot Singh Sidhu had himself said a couple of days back while addressing a press conference saying that the party's decision will be acceptable to both the power centers led by Navjot Singh Sidhu and even Charanjit Singh Channi Sidhu uh, had also clarified that both of them were in favor of uh, announcing this chief ministerial face as that will benefit the party. Uh, Sidhu had also claimed that if uh, a clarity is given on the chief ministerial face, party can get 5 to 10 percent more votes and even if the uh, manifesto suggested by him is implemented that will also add more seats to the Congress's kitty in Punjab this time. The, this is what Navjot Singh Sidhu had said, but on the other, Navjot Singh Sidhu has been pushing his candidature for the post of chief minister, uh, uh, chief ministers, uh, then by saying that he has come up with a vision that will take the Punjab forward, uh, that will bring uh, the, the Punjab out of the shackles of the debt as Punjab is a huge, huge debt of nearly 3 lakh crore rupees. So while at one hand Navjot Singh Sidhu is saying the decision of the party will be acceptable to him and Charanjit Singh Channi, on the other, he is sulking and putting pressure on the party high command to declare him as the chief initial candidate. But source is saying that the decision may come within a week's period. Navjot Singh Sidhu had also said that Rahul Gandhi had said that hmm. party will be deciding a chief minister face within a week. So we are expecting all fingers crossed, but there is a lot of anxiety in both the camps in Punjab. Okay, lots of anxiety in both the camps. And might I just say that Sidhu is a very impulsive man, uh, you know, and therefore nobody wants to take one side or another when it comes to Sidhu, including the Congress leadership. You know, they've burnt their fingers with Sidhu in the past. Now they're wondering what has gone wrong. This was always a ticking time bomb. The naming of the chief ministerial face in Punjab was a ticking time bomb, but now with Rahul Gandhi declaring that they are going to name the chief ministerial face, uh, he's, the, the Congress has painted itself into a corner. They will have to go ahead and name that person. Is it going to be Channi as the buzz suggests? Is it going to be someone else, uh, which is quite unlikely at this point of time? We'll have to see how Sidhu reacts. He's also already given us an impression of what's going on in his mind at this time. And remember, the impression now is that the Congress continues to be divided by factions, whereas its arch rival in Punjab, the Aam Admi Party, appears to have its house completely in order. Take a look once again at this exclusive. Navjot Singh Sidhu, perhaps for the first time in history, saying no comment.